In the body, there's rarely ever anything uh, such as a complete on or a complete off. For example, when we have glucose, so I'm going to put glucose here, and it gets converted into glucose 6-phosphate by, uh, by a glucokinase. So I'm just put gl GK, glucokinase. And it gets converted back into glucose by glucose 6-phosphatase. In some cases, glucose 6-phosphatase is favored and glucose is the net product. In other cases, glucokinase is favored and glucose 6-phosphate is the net product. However, glucose 6-phosphatase is never really completely off, or usually not, it's also, I'll not say never, but it's usually not completely off, and glucokinase is usually not completely off. Neither one of them is ever really completely off or completely on. They're just upregulated up -regulated and downregulated. So this gives us something of a, what's called a feudal cycle. So if both of these things are running at the same time, you basically just have a cycle going from glucose to glucose 6-phosphate and back to glucose again. This is uh, because there is no net activity, uh, this is known as a feudal cycle. There are many things in the body uh, that are termed as feudal cycles. Um, some of them are true feudal cycles like this, some of them aren't. But this uh, occurrence is actually... Uh, not even a true feudal cycle because there's a point in it. Now, whenever you take glucose and add a phosphate group, you're taking this phosphate, which is limited in, in each cell. You only have so much of it, and you're, you're binding it up into glucose, so it's no longer free and able to be used. So in order to prevent all of the cell's phosphate from being tied up, the glucose 6-phosphatase remaining active prevents that from happening. And so you either upregulate or downregulate one or the other or both enzymes depending on what the net product is that you need. Neither of them goes uh, completely on or off. There's some exception. Glucokinase can be bound up inside the nucleus. So it can be turned off that way, but not all of the glucokinase, from my understanding, will be bound up in the nucleus. So you never get a complete on or off. Now, the way that happens, actually, there's a glucokinase regulatory protein and when it's active it takes glucokinase and shunts it into the nucleus of the cell and uh, when it's in the nucleus it can't act on glucose so it's completely off in that f in that matter and actually fructose 6-phosphate is what activates the glucokinase regulatory pro uh, protein